Hi, JobTread Pros. I'm excited to introduce the new payments dashboard to you. You can access your payment dashboard if you're an administrator in JobTread or if you have manage access to bills or invoices. Also, this payment dashboard can be accessed from multiple locations within JobTread. So let's dig in and I'll show you what we've got. So you'll access the main dashboard by clicking on documents in your main navigation and then clicking on the payments tab. Here you'll see all incoming and outgoing payments, whether they're applied or not. And these payments include those from our Evo integration, our Stripe integration, the QuickBooks Online integration, or any payments that you manually enter yourself. So here we'll see these payments are from both customers and to vendors. And then also you can leverage custom views to view this information in different ways. So we've included a view for you to view customer payments versus vendor payments, and then also any unapplied payments. The nice thing here too, is that you have the ability to add a payment by clicking on the plus payment button. You can search for the vendor or customer, and then you'll say whether it's a received payment or whether you made a payment out and then you'll go ahead and enter the information for that payment. Once you save it, you can click on the payment in the list and then apply it to a document that you've already created in JobTread. So here we have an unapplied amount and you can see all of the open invoices or any draft invoices for this customer in particular. Also, you can click on any of these payments that have been applied to a document and then you'll see the document that it is applied to. Once you click on that, it'll open up the document for you and you can take action as needed. Also within this payments tool, you do have the ability to create a view maybe to help you do some cleanup in the system in case you have some duplicate payments that maybe you're, you're concerned about. I've created a view called payments by account and here I've chosen to sort my view by the account type, account name, the payment date, and then the received amount. And so here I might notice some duplicate um, data. So this is a great way to start cleaning up your data, dig in a little bit and make sure that everything is accounted for appropriately. Now you can view this payments dashboard in your job. So if you click on jobs, choose that particular job and then go to the documents tab now you'll notice that we have a payments view you also can view payments by your customers so if we click on customers choose that particular customer click on the payments tab which is top level here so you have quick access to it and then you'll notice that we have all the payments associated with that customer logged right here and then you also have it within your vendors. So we'll click on a vendor, choose that particular vendor, and you'll notice any payment made toward that vendor. We hope that this payment dashboard is helpful to you and that you can start keeping track of all of your incoming and outgoing payments so that everything is one in one place and you make sure that everything is accounted for.